Hello guys, uh, is a technical guy from uh, setnacast.com. Um, we stream your radio station like a boss. Also, we offer um, radio online services with very, very good prices. Nobody has prices like setnacast.com. Go and check and look for your your needs. So, I'm here today to show you a um, full tutorial video how to convert songs in um, right BPM. Um, also, I will show you how to keep all songs with the same volume with audio compressor so it's very very good idea I found by myself and for searching a lot and uh, a lot of uh, a lot of users said to me how to use audio processor from radio online we need to use audio processor but we don't know how to do some of them said we have to get songs one by one in Adobe Audition and uh, raise the volume up and normalize the volume and things so I found a way the way is very easy is with two software one of them is DB Power Ramp this software is incredible uh, software I, re I love this software I have used this software since 2003 so it's 15 years old it's very very good software it can convert bunch of files a lot of mp3 files all your mp3 files in the second it can convert in your right bpm also this software support uh, dsp effects very very good also it support vst effect so you have your own processor vct pro vst processor and you can use it I found this broadcast processor. I love this processor. It's very, very nice. You can download it. It's free. It's here. Download it. I have it here in desktop. It's DLL. So I will show you how to configure it. Don't worry about that. Also, here is the program. So if you want to buy this, I suggest you to buy, but I I will you I will share my software with you, but you have to to have your own software. So okay, use mine for the moment. Uh, I will share you a, a link in description. See description below, and download it. So here is the link. Okay. Oh, both of them. No, um, audio processor and uh, DB power amp music converter are here in this link you can download it here download I have in the desktop so I don't need it now I have it here here is the download folder it's processor and it, okay now next step is you have to install this but carefully you have to install in 32 bits because in 64 bits VST softwares don't work you have to install in uh, in 32 bits to install in 32 bit you need to keep the shift button the right shift not the left one B both of them uh, the, the the right one keep it now double click here at the software double click so don't forget you need to keep it shift hold you can see the registered version is 32 bit okay yes you need to install 32 bit don't forget that because it can work So now I have installed it before. Now let the button off. You see, now DV 
power amp. So now we have to configure the audio processor. Okay. To create, you have to create a folder in C drive, program files, 86 here. Create a folder with the name VST plugins. Create this folder VST plugin and place this DLL here at this folder inside. Okay? Now, now, where are the songs? Here are my songs. All the songs, I have to convert it. Some of the songs, as you know, it has some space in the between, in the beginning or in the end. Let's test this one. Let me show you. Okay. I have uh, compressed before, but let's do like this. Okay. And let's see now. Wait a second. We can put some space in the beginning. In the end, put some space. Need to Put some. Let's suppose you have the song like this, but you don't like because, you know, it's minus three, I think, dB, and space here, and space here. So now, this song, it's not correct for transmission. So now, select all these files, because I need to convert it all. Convert to, as you see, it's here convert to okay okay let me show you okay now choose the convert um, mp3 I use 192 kilobit per second it's constant bit rate for me yeah it's good for some of a cast it's constant bit rate better I use it here Okay, advanced, slowest but high quality. I use this. Okay, I remove all of this. Channels auto as source. It's nice. Okay, now output the same source or another source you, you need. Now it's an option here add, add DSP effects very 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 needed i use i use uh, this um trim silence and i use minus 38 trim silence from a beginning and from the end this is the reason why i love this soft because it can remove the spaces that's okay and DSP effects we can use our audio processor VST plugin here here is the folder can you see you remember we create the folder we place the plugin the plugin is here okay nice choose it DP okay that's good I never um, did any changes here because it can get automatically don't worry about that it's nice here it is hit ok so now we are ready to convert all songs and you can see the difference overwrite I use always overwrite so we are converting songs now also this software is um, using that broadcast audio processor in the same time and it's wonderful all songs are the same volume so it's done look at this now hey look at this no space no nothing and the song is processed so 
these songs are ready to upload in Centovacast. So, guys, I see you in the next video. I, I can show you how to upload these songs in the Centovacast. Thank you for watching.